Every week there are new Flutter and Dart packages on PubDev. As always, I present you with the 10 most liked ones among the releases of week 50 R. A package that enables you to position your app menu on the right side of the screen and open it by swiping. Another onboarding solution for creating customized walkthrough screens. A package for creating very special color effects using a color range of 360 degrees and 7 more useful packages that made it into the top 10 of the week. Welcome to some tech ops. My name is Jay and this channel is all about programming. If you enjoy Flutter content and want to be notified about the weekly package releases, subscribe to this channel and now let's get started with calendar week 50. When developing apps, you usually go through different phases or stages. The most common stages are the development stage when your app is still in development and the production stage when your app is already published and can be used by others. Between the two stages you can further subdivide into for example alpha or beta. If your app is already published it means that the database already contains real data. As it is risky to change an already published app it is recommended to create an environment for each of the mentioned phases or stages. This way you can work with a test database in your development environment and if everything works, you transfer the changes to the production environment where the correct database is automatically attached. For this scenario, it makes sense to use so-called environment variables, variables that are dependent on the current environment. With the package environment flavor, you get a new simple way to manage your environment variables. To make it easier for the users of your app to get started, you can for example create an onboarding for them in which you explain the most important functions of your app. For this occasion you can take a look at the package Flutter walkthrough screen with which you can create customized onboarding screens for your app. In Flutter we don't have many possibilities to position our menus on top as app bar, at the bottom as bottom app bar or using a pop-up triggered by a button. The following package allows you to position your menus sideways with menu Kurukupatial, which stands for cross menu. You can position your menu centrally on the right hand side and open it by swiping. Additionally, you can even change the position of the indicator. A nice way to make your app more user friendly is to use chatbots. With YM Flutter integration you get a widget to display them. Furthermore you can control the behavior of the chatbot by making it react only to certain events. Maybe you study computer science or software development and deal with the topic of data structures or you have a special requirement for your Flutter app which depends on linear data structures. With the package Linear Structures you get the implementation of all linear data structures like singly linked list, doubly linked list, stack and queue. To send several hundreds or thousands of SMS messages you can use so called bulk SMS services and the package bulk SMS ZW helps you to do this. The documentation recommends creating an account at bulksmsweb.com if you use this service, please be aware that this website does not have SSL encryption, which means that your data will be transmitted unencrypted. The market for packages that offer responsiveness in Flutter apps does not seem to be saturated yet. The package Simply Responsive takes a new approach by providing a three column design instead of the well known 12 grid system. This comes with higher simplicity but at the cost of reduced flexibilities. It is also mentioned that this works with both orientations, landscape or portrait. On week 38 I introduce you to the package Floaty Hat for creating custom chat heads like the ones we know from popular messenger services. Another solution of this kind is offered by the package Float Button Overlay enabling you to display a floating action button while your app is running in the background. If your app depends on certain properties of the device, for example the network type or the country code, then check out the package Carrier Info which retrieves such information from both Android and iOS devices. Last but not least, the champion of week 50 with modest 10 likes, U-Rotation. 
providing you with a widget that performs a U rotation on the child's color. You can set the degrees around the color circle. With a full rotation of 360 degrees you get the same color as you get with 0 degrees and with 180 degrees you get a complementary color. For more information check out the documentation. Since the launch in July, until this moment, 989 people have made the decision to subscribe to my channel and this is a great compliment for which I would like to take this opportunity once again to say thank you. Thank you to all the viewers, to all the subscribers and also thank you for the nice comments I get on a regular basis. To all of you who celebrate Christmas, I wish you a Merry Christmas. Stay healthy and don't let the circumstances get you down. Have a nice day and see you soon.